What a better way to kick off this channel than by touching on some fundamentals. In this video, we're going to be talking about the differences between science, technology and engineering. First, we'll start by briefly defining them, then later on, state their differences where I'll give you some interesting examples. My name is Hassan Kigo, a final year chemical engineering student studying in Russia. Welcome to my channel where we'll be talking about engineering, tech, engineering student life, study tips and so on. If all this sounds interesting to you, please subscribe, turn on the notifications so anytime we upload, you'll be notified. Before we get into their differences, we have to first define them briefly. First, we got science. What is science? Science is the study of natural phenomena, period. I don't want to go too deep, but science creates a body of knowledge that includes um, explanations, you know, observations of, uh, sorry, observations and explanations of natural processes. That pretty much defines it like I said briefly next we got technology technology actually comprises of two Greek words one is techne and the other is logia techne as in technique you know skills methods well logia means the study of for example you have cosmology the study of the cosmos technology you know then we have biology psychology, physiology, and so on. So technology, we can say, refers to the methods, the tools used to produce desired products, to solve problems, to satisfy wants. Then engineering. Engineering is the use of scientific principles to build and design machines, structures, that solve practical problems. Now that we've defined them briefly, let's talk about their differences. The truth is, their distinction is not always clear. Science, as we established, studies nature and creates a body of knowledge, we can say. While technology and engineering, they actually really complement each other because they all tend to solve problems. Let me give you some examples to help you understand them better, to, to help you understand their differences and also how they relate with each other. Scientists understand why things float on water. Then engineers apply that knowledge to create ships. Voila! <laughs> or physicists understand electronics which then brings about the creation of the chip technology, which is uh, the making of microprocessors, which we have in our devices, we have in our phones, in our computers, in our cars even. Then engineers apply that technology to make cars, like for example, Tesla, or to, to make computers. Another example, Scientists understand uh, thermodynamics, which then brings about the creation of the internal combustion engine, which we have in our cars that converts uh, gasoline into motion. That's a technology in and of itself. Then engineers apply that technology to make cars. I hope you're with me. Another example, scientists understand how birds fly, which engineers then apply to make airplanes, basically. <laughs> Let me finish with this last line. Science creates the basic knowledge of this world. Engineers apply that knowledge in a practical way to create technology. I hope that makes sense. Anyway, Finally, we've come to the end of this video. If you've learned something, please hit the like button. Okay, tap the like button. Subscribe if you've not subscribed. Thank you.
very much for coming here signing off now see you on the next one